Hi guys, it's your boy Jay again from Vehicle Diaries. Today we'll be trying something different. We'll be going to get a vehicle for a client, so you guys will be riding along. Don't forget to like and subscribe as we well we'll go on this adventure of finding a vehicle for a client. I prefer choice to be a 2003 Honda Accord, popularly known as End of Discussion. Had this one to check out, so be heading over there right now you know things are really expensive nowadays so we just hope it falls within the client's budget and of course with less things to spend on uh, well fingers crossed you know things are really expensive now thanks to the dollar to naira uh, rate well here it is uh, silver 2300 accord looks good on the outside but who knows beauty may be skin deep well we'll take a look around the vehicle yeah first missing thing uh side mirror cap that's more to spend on and you know you must spend on things especially when getting an enduring use vehicle uh the tires still have some life left in them yeah obviously but you can see that place has been sprayed the one that is shiny the car obviously has been painted over when you look it seems like it has a lot of paint on the inside so you might wonder what really what baggage does this car come with from its previous owner you see a lot has been swept under the rug on that dashboard i don't know what exactly but of course oh there you are scars from a previously abusive relationship this car has been accidented that's enough for us to call it quits on this particular vehicle i guess we just have to go and search for another i know the client was kind of skeptical and she really wanted silver but we move hopefully we'll find something that would fall within the budget and wouldn't cost us much to spend on and that's non-accidented as well that's a lot to look for especially when trying to pick up your nigerian used car there are many things you have to check out for anybody trying to sell out their car they're trying to sell off for a reason so we have to be really careful well here's another i stumbled on stumbled on apparently the owner just came to service the vehicle looks kind of dirty at first but then who knows a proper bath there the spa i bring out the beauty in this one oh what's it called ugly duckling black beauty oh looks like they're changing the alternator belt well that's one less thing to fix by ourselves now we stand in the Nigerian used car, we still have to make some changes like the exhaust net, shock absorbers, the engine seat, making sure the engine now was also changed. Let's take a look at the inside, shall we? Um, volume control, buttons, modes, steering wheel, um, power pitted moonroof, uh, power pitted um, windows central lock auto dimming side mirrors your side mirror adjustment sound system dual climate control cd auxiliary six cd changer emfm airbags oh. heated and cool seats for both driver and front passenger cup holders of course it's holding its banner now storage space more storage space very deep glove box oh look more storage space leather seats well for one that's been used in nigeria for a while no much wear and tear of course it's wear and tear but not that much leather wrap steering wheel but i think they're gonna prefer to just leave this steering wrap on it uh hidden storage for the sun sun shades venti mirror with lights for both driver and passenger there you go very 
blood space in the rest. Power breaker, um, windows, storage, storage in the back seat as well. Uh, no rear AC vent, of course, this is 2003. That's also power printed window. Uh, nice sound systems, all still functional. Uh, oh, look, internal storage with this key. You can open and find access to the boot cup holder. So that's an armrest as well. Headrest for the rear passengers. Lots of space, new room. And enough headroom as well. Unfortunately, I'm holding the camera so I can't see my head. But I can assure you. Alloy rims, um, 16 inches alloy rims. What's under the hood? Oh, there you are. A 2.4 liter dual overhead cam, IV Tech. That's VTEC with intelligence, variable valve timing, and electronic lift control with intelligence. This, this engine is almost bulletproof. 2003 Honda Accord. Oh, let me check the trunk space. Yeah, you push for the full cap, pull for the trunk. Full cap. Yeah, you have your storage for your jack and your wheel spanner. You got your spare tire. Yep, that's the passage from the rear seat to the trunk. Your speakers are still intact. Here's an interesting feature you might not know about the O3. I don't know if this has it, but press once, press second time, and hold down so as to wind down the windows. Or is it three times? Let's see. One, two, three. There you go. <laughs> Isn't that amazing? Yeah, with the car running 
and now you can see the vanity mirrors dead lights pop up pop, pop. yep as you can see yeah so including the red lights they all come on so yeah yo yeah cool. there you go so you can see the temperature yeah you can turn it down low passenger side is also low but you can increase the sun temperature that's dual passenger so as you can see instantly instantly cold instantly yeah it's on that off Alright, is there anything else? Yeah, Harry drives, but you'll see soon. So it's the final D-Day, time for the car to meet its owner. I'm sure she's really excited. So am I. Uh, Kadnats Abuja Road can be dreadful, but I was looking forward to driving this car. The engine was smooth, gear selection was superb, AC was chilling. Basically this car was everything I was proud to deliver for an Nigerian East car at least. So it was a very smooth trip. In another two hours, they're about outside the grace in Abuja. Oh, there it is. The rock that reminds me I'm close. Zuma Rock. Or is it Jacob Zuma? No, Zuma Rock. Well, finally in Abuja town. Off to meet with my client. I'm sure she's going to be happy with what I got her. And yes, she was. And she's taking away her pride and joy. Well, I've become the latest hitchhiker in Abuja. Now it's time for me to find my way back home. Thanks for joining me on this journey. Until next time, guys. Peace.